What's up you guys? I am here in Uluwatu, Bali. We originally planned to stay here for two days and now we loved it so much we've extended our vacation for another week. Uluwatu is one hour away from Shenggu and there's so much to do here from amazing beaches, amazing restaurants, great Hotel, some of the best hotels in Bali. So I want to give you guys the breakdown for your next trip to Bali This might just be one of my favorite parts of Bali. Let's get into it I'm gonna be showing you guys everything and more and before we get into it Make sure you comment you like and subscribe join the family guys, but yeah, let's go <laughs> All right guys, so we are in our car we, we call it a Gojek and our next destination is 15 minutes away. We are going to be enjoying a romantic candlelit dinner. This is one of the things I recommend you do if here in Uluwatu. You can have dinner on the beach, which is just so beautiful. And or you can have dinner at one of the hotels here. They always have a one on one candlelit dinner with a private chef and private staff. So I would highly recommend checking it out. I'm super, super excited. We have a curated menu and all of that. So I'm gonna show you guys what that's like. And the price range of this was about $60 per person. So $120 total with a full course, three course meal and some wine. So let's get into it guys. I'll show you guys when we get there. Thank you. Thank you so much. What's up you guys? So we just arrived here at Tirta Bali and this place is just so incredible. I'm just blown away by the views and the staff here is amazing. We're about to eat and we'll show you guys what the food is like but wow this place is insane. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know you were vlogging. Guys, this dinner has been so perfect. Like, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, we're having a dessert now, and this is grilled corn pudding. And it looks so good and so artistic. Oh my god. <laughs> So guys, we just ended dinner and I think I had a little bit too much red wine. I'm not even gonna lie, but the whole dinner was so amazing. And I've just had the best night and it's just been so magical. I feel like a princess. I would highly recommend doing something like this. Everything was amazing. The food was impeccable and I'm ready to go to sleep. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. Let's go to the beach. Beach, let's go get away. Ooh, I see it. I see it. Man, this is like over there. No, 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 no. It's actually not. Guys, I was catfished. Guys, so we've been walking for 10 minutes in the wilderness and we're still not there. We're not even halfway, so. I feel, I feel, I feel hurt. This is bad. I didn't sign up for this shit. Go without me. The guy said 25 minutes. Stop recording each day. Instead, freaking 25 minutes of hiking. I'm just confused. What is that? <sighs> no! 
ever again, Sway. Then we made it, Joe. <laughs> Guys, I'm just happy. Like, this is what happiness and fulfillment and good vibes looks like, okay? <laughs> Guys, we made it to Nyang Nyang Beach here in Uluwatu, and this beach is so gorgeous. I'm so excited and so happy after literally the most treacherous hike I've ever experienced. Like, that hike was crazy. Not ever experienced, because Peru was actually a lot, but that hike was crazy. The beach is empty, and the views, the water, incredible. Was it worth it? I guess so. I was so dramatic, but I'm glad that we're here and we're just gonna relax and enjoy the day. Guys, so the beach is called Nyang Nyang Beach. It is in Uluwatu, 30 minute hike. Just giving you guys some specs. There are not a lot of restaurants or like beach chairs and all of that here. So make sure you bring your camera, make sure you bring your water, your shoes, your towels, everything you need because you're not really gonna have um, a lot of resources once you get here. It's kind of a little bit deserted, which I love because you know in Bali, the beaches here can get packed. So it's nice to not see a lot of people and I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of the day here. So I wanna give you perspective on how far we hiked. Okay, can you guys see that white house? I'm gonna try to zoom in. Can you see that right there? That house? Literally, that's where we came from, all the way up through here. Oh, guys, it was a lot. I'm not even gonna lie, that was a lot. So guys, this is the book that I've been reading. It's called Your Next Five Moves, Master the Art of Business Strategy by Patrick and David. I absolutely, absolutely love him and I have been enjoying this book. And I brought it to enjoy the beach and just read. I love to read when I'm at the beach. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. Our beach day is officially over. This place is so incredible. And now there are a few more people on the beach, probably around 10 or 12, but there's plenty of space for everyone. And guys, I've just had the most beautiful day. And I have sand in all of the cracks and crevices, TMI. But yeah, we're about to head back up. And tomorrow we are going to Kamakandra Beach Club for a spa day and some drinks on the beach. Kamakandra is one of the most popular beach clubs here in Uluwatu, so I'm excited to check it out. Let's go. <laughs> What's up guys? So we're here at Kamakandra Beach Club and they also have a spa. And so another thing that you can do here in Uluwatu and anywhere in Bali is of course a spa day. And after that treacherous hike yesterday, we're about to enjoy a nice relaxing 60 minute massage. What's up you guys? So we are here at Karma Kandra Resort in Uluwatu, a little bit on the Ungasan side of Uluwatu. And this is a beach club and spa. We just did a 60 minute Balinese massage and sea salt body scrub. And 
you can do a massage anywhere in Bali, but this one is so special because it literally overlooks the ocean on a cliff and you can see the water and you can hear the waves crashing during your massage. It was so relaxing and now we are going to head down to the beach club and enjoy some drinks, get in the water, soak up the sun. And this place is really, really cool because the beach club has so many amazing activities, so I'm excited to check it out. This treatment cost us 500,000 IDR per person, which is, I think, I believe around $25. I'm going to put this pricing because <laughs> I don't have the conversion right in my head, but 500,000 IDR per person and definitely worth it. Super relaxing. I'm obsessed. Okay, after spa, balloon, then Guys, so we are here at the Karma Beach Club. The ride down is a little bit scary, but it's so much better than walking. And we're about to go to the beach. So guys, we are staying at the Radisson Hotel. I didn't mention that earlier. We're staying at the Radisson Blue in Uluwatu. It is gorgeous. I'm gonna pop some pictures and videos. I had a feeling you'd come back and save me From all those lonely nights and heartbreaks And I feel misplaced without you Why don't we go back to Why don't we go back to Never wanted to end so beautiful i would highly recommend it we love it so far breakfast has been amazing staff has been amazing and today we are actually heading over to ayana resort they have this really really popular restaurant called the rock bar and it's overlooking the ocean on a cliff i'm super excited to go check that out so let's go guys <laughs> Guys, this place is absolutely incredible. One of the top rated restaurants here in Bali, not just Uluwatu. The sunset was breathtaking. I'm ready to eat as well. I'm excited to try the food, but wow, so stunning. Highly recommend it. Bali bucket list for sure. <laughs> It is day five and today we are heading all the way over to Uluwatu's cliff a short drive away from Uluwatu temple and today we are doing a picnic private picnic on the edge of a cliff this just might be one of the craziest things I've ever done but it's so beautiful so romantic and of course we had to bring Miss Ginger my new puppy with us I'm super excited this entire experience was beyond expectations the views of Uluwatu and the coastline were incredible the breeze from the top a little bit scary don't go too close to that edge okay but Wow, the videos don't even do it justice, but let's go. I want to show you. Okay guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm actually gonna be coming back to you guys with so many more incredible villa tours in Bali and beyond once travel starts popping off again. But um, yeah, I'm gonna come to you guys with some modern style villas, hotels that you can stay in, in Ubud. 
Oh, and guys, you guys always ask me, what is my company? Chitty Ashley Travels, I'm gonna link it down below. Make sure you reach out if you're looking to travel to Bali sometime next year. We have some amazing travel deals from $800 per person with a private chef, private driver, full team here in Bali that is at your service and trips curated by me with all of the best things to do in Bali and they're tailored for your taste so definitely check that out I have some amazing Bali trips I also have some group trips if you're a solo traveler looking to come to Bali and meet friends uh, so yeah make sure you check all of those out we have some amazing 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 trips you know guys you know this is what I love to do so yeah Stay tuned for more videos. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, all of that jazz. And I'll see you guys very soon.